It's time for my April monthly favorites. I can't believe that April's over and we're almost into the summer month, summer months, which is actually my favorite time of year. It's when my birthday is and I think that you can get out and do the most outside. So, um, but let's jump into it today. I'm gonna start off with my makeup beauty favorites. Um, those are always my favorite to start off with. Um, First, for you guys, I have a bronzer from Physicians Formula, and I've been like so obsessed with bronzers lately. I've been trying a lot of new ones out because I felt like I didn't really have a great one for my skin tone, but this has like a um, four different kinds that you like just swirl your brush in and creates a really like subtle uh, glimmering effect, and this is actually in their O light lightest shade and it's just perfect for light skin tones and I just like the the variety of the shades I think it gives you like a natural glow and it's not too shimmery but not like too matte or too you know really obvious on your face that you're wearing a bunch of bronzer so I've been loving that next has been my Anastasia brow Wiz pencil and I've just been loving this it's it's the best brow pencil I've ever used um, on one side you get the color to fill in your brows and then on the other side is a spoolie so that you can comb through the color and make it look really natural. And I have the bl the, the blonde color, like the dark blonde color, and it's, it's awesome for me. This formula is great. The product's great. I can't say enough things. It's, it's awesome and I think everyone should have one. Next has been a blush been into face products. Um, it's from the Balm, actually. It's one of their in-stain balms, so it's really long-wearing, and when I open this color, it's going to look pretty crazy, but it's this really bright um, pink color here, and it's in the shade Lace, and I, it, I know it seems really bright, but if you have kind of like pale skin like me with cool with um pinky undertones really cool um cool blushes are the best for your skin tone and this is just like a really cool shade of pink um and it looks really great and i'm not wearing it today i probably should have been but um this stuff i will say a little goes a long way so you don't want to put a lot on just a little bit and it's it's really beautiful i love it and it's great stain power um but again don't put too much on or you're gonna look kind of like you know, you're coming from the circus or something. So next for jewelry, um, I've actually been loving these aiming these earrings from Jamie. They're um, they're really cool and interesting design. They kind of just like hang like this. They're the Ezra earring, and they actually Shoshana from the show Girls on HBO wore these in one of the episodes, and I just like have been loving them. I think they're so cool. So definitely unique jewelry piece. The other thing I have from for jewelry is my actually my Coachella wristband. Um, this was my favorite accessory during Coachella, and I'll link down below all of my Coachella posts. But I had an awesome time, and feel free to check those out if you want to hear all about my experience. Um, next, I have some kind of skincare and hair care things related to Coachella and just what I was loving this month. Um, in order to get kind of a bronze glow, I tried out a product that I hadn't used before, and it's um, a self-tanner product by the brand Vita Liberata, and I never heard of this, um, but it's just a, a self-tanning mousse that you apply with this mitt, and you can tell that I've used it, but you just slide the mitt on, and I've never used a mitt like this for self-tanning, but it works awesome. Like, I did this... Um, one day and then I did it the next night and I had this great self tan for like 15 days that lasted and it looks really natural and it's was, it was very easy to apply with the mitt so I, I recommend that. Thinking about doing a whole self tanner post because I'm all about protecting your skin and doing it in a safe way to get some color. And speaking of that, I have discovered I think the best sunscreen ever. Like if you can burn easily like I do, you should go get this right now. Like I have been using this when I've been outside for like eight to 10 hours or something like that crazy when you really need a lot of protection. And this stuff, this Neutrogena Beach Defense and it's a water and sun barrier has been just awesome. You can see it's really gr dirty and grungy because I've been using it so much. But this, I don't get burnt at all with this. It's like amazing and it comes in this awesome spray format. So I love this. And speaking of other kind of 
skincare products. This is actually something for your hair, which a lot of people don't think about, but I get my hair colored and I invest a lot in it and I want to keep it looking great. I don't want the sun to interfere. So I actually picked up this, um, L'Oreal Color Vibrancy Dual Protect Spray and this has been awesome for protecting my hair color. I think that if you invest in hair color you need to protect it and there aren't a lot of actually like drugstore color protectants, UV protectants. This is you know UV heat filters it protects against and this drugstore it's only like five or six dollars. It does an awesome job. I used to have a high-end one that was way too expensive and this has been serving just the purpose. I've been outside so much this month and my hair color still looks amazing. So then for other skincare products, I've been lover loving this Eucerin Redness Relief Daily um, daily perfecting lotion it has a spf 15 in it and it actually comes out in this green color you can see it says um with subtle green color neutralizers and it's just awesome if you have kind of ready skin that you want to kind of neutralize when before you put your makeup on this product does an awesome job it's it's a really, really sensitive product. I have kind of sensitive skin and I have just been loving it. It comes in this great pump format. I'll kind of put a little bit out so you can see the green color because it's kind of interesting. So it's definitely greeny, but it, it blends in and neutralizes your skin and it's just an awesome product. So next I have um, something for your eyes and it's this eye cream that I've been loving from Target. It's from the brand Botanics and it's 80% organic and it's just a really hydrating eye cream. I get really dry around my eyes and I think if you're not using an eye cream you need to go out and get one right now because I think it's an underutilized beauty product that can help prevent aging in the future and this brand is just from Target. It was about ten dollars but I only use a teeny little bit. I think this is gonna last me for a really long time and I'm loving it. It's super hydrating and great for your eyes. So next for fashion I just have a couple favorite pieces so as most of you know I went to Lucky Fab this month and my favorite shoes that I wore were these Jeffrey Campbell shoes that I got from Nordstrom Rack for a really awesome discount um, so they're just really interesting heels I love I love wedges lately that have just an interesting lace-up design on them and I wanted some I didn't want black ones I wanted something interesting and I have just been loving these and they zip up they're super comfortable just awesome. I can wear them to work, I can wear them out, a variety of occasions. And something that I got for, for, for Coachella actually was this uh, crochet top and I got it from Foreign Exchange which is, a, which is a chain here in California in the mall but I've been seeing them everywhere and I'm not necessarily referencing this one but I just think these are awesome to get for the spring and summer. Like you can wear a cute bandeau and throw this over. You can wear this over your swimsuit. Um, it's just really, I think, cute and fun for spring and summer. And something that I think also everyone should have that I became so helpful this month is just like a great, cute little backpack that you can wear. And I have this one. This is actually a present from my boyfriend. Um, it's just like a leather one with some cute detailing and pockets. And it's just... It's just cute to wear, um, kind of change it up from a purse, I think, and it holds a lot and it's really cute. So I've just been loving this one. This one's actually just from Forever 21. So I think that everyone should have one of these. And then to kind of close it off, I just want to share some of my favorite TV shows that I've been into for April. So this month I got really addicted to two different series, Scandal and White Collar. So if you haven't watched Scandal, you need to start watching it right now. I know some people are turned off to it because people seem so addicted to it, but if you like House of Cards or like political type of thrillers, you're going to love Scandal. And I think that everyone should go watching it, should go start watching it right now. It's on Netflix, the old seasons, and the third season, the most recent one, just had the season finale, and I won't ruin it if you haven't started it. Um, and then White Collar has also been awesome. It's about this ex-con turned FBI agent, which sounds kind of stereotypical for a TV show, but it's just nice to watch and get sucked in. I'm always into new shows that I can watch a bunch of episodes of. And then lastly, for my LA hot spots that have been my favorites, um, I went to, I just love the bungalow. It's in Santa Monica and it's just, if you have friends visiting or if you want to go somewhere that's just super LA themed, go there. It's like, I feel like you can't go anywhere like this. 
um, or there's not a place like this anywhere else. It's just this cool beachy bar um, that has a really cool laid back vibe, but also fun to go out in at night. It's, it's a super long line, so get there like at least by nine if you don't wanna be waiting like an hour in line. And the other um, place I actually tried out was a brunching spot in Studio City called Spark Woodfire Grill. And they have $6 bottomless mimosas and awesome brunch. And I went there with some friends and had an awesome time. So I definitely recommend checking those two places out. So let me know what products you've been loving for April. And I'd love to hear from you guys. If not, stay tuned to my next video.